So here's what we're going to monitor the next couple of days. Really great look at weather for Thursday. Mix of clouds and sunshine. Highs right around the mid 70s. We'll flip that right around into Friday and this is going to be the impacts we're going to feel on Friday. A gusty breeze with some late day rain showers and I do expect we're going to see highs in the mid 70s. Some on and off showers into the weekend Saturday and into Sunday, but there still will be plenty of dry weather into the weekend. I did want to update you on this though. Now statewide in Ohio, we've now confirmed 71 tornadoes in 2024 with one new one just confirmed. That was yesterday afternoon and that was confirmed down in Preble County, Ohio. It now puts us uh, deeper into record territory for the most confirmed tornadoes ever in the state of Ohio. Another tornado confirmation was up in Hillsdale County, a very brief EF zero tornado with wind speeds to 65 miles per hour. That was located near Camden uh, and it was on the ground very briefly for about a minute at 622. Now a quick update in the tropics. We are bound to have a major hurricane uh, and this hurricane is going to be gathering strength. Rapid intensification going to be moving northward and it will make a landfall tomorrow evening and this is the latest data. A major category 4 hurricane with winds to 130 miles per hour and could even see some further strengthening just before landfall. So what will be the impacts for our area? How about Friday? The winds are going to pick up as that system nears uh, northwest Ohio. Ohio. Winds will gust early in the morning, 20 to 25 miles per hour, peaking out into the afternoon, 35 to up to 40 miles per hour. Keep this in mind, Friday night football games, windy weather and the chance wet weather will roll in. So let's track the latest on that one and how that tropical moisture is going to draw on shore through the southeastern corner of the United States and eventually making its way up into the Ohio River Valley region. It's late Friday. There's a clock, 4 p.m. Rain showers working into the southern edge of our viewing area and Friday Friday evening, that's when rain returns into our area. Some of that remnant tropical moisture. Highs on Thursday will reach at the mid 70s. Dry weather on Thursday. Now keep in mind, Friday with those winds whipping up, it is going to be rough on Lake Erie. Waves five to eight feet could build up to 10 feet. So stay away from Lake Erie Friday and no. Friday night football games will have the chance of rain showers and gusty winds. 74, your high on Friday, mid 70s into Saturday. A few on and off rain showers into the weekend, Saturday into Sunday. Slightly better chance Sunday afternoon with lingering showers early next week, Monday into Tuesday. And as we roll into early October, a few days in the upper 60s and low 70s, right on track for this time of year.